one I said you know, to go off and get himself ready is that this is no easy feat. This isn't easy, man. This is what, what they're attempting to do is what I have right up here. One, two, three boxes of bites. And you just saw Jeff. I mean, Jeff Davis just went through a box of bites and you saw how it was. So, you know, doing this takes the utmost concentration, utmost dedication. And I mean, you got to put yourself, it's not, it's, you know, and I want to be serious. It's no joking matter. These chocolates are, they are dangerous. They're, they're hot. And I mean, but they're still chocolate. Not to be fooled around with, no jokes. You know, I, I don't like people that play jokes on people with like, here, try this chocolate skin and then laugh. No, I, you know, I tell everyone that, you know, this is going to burn you. This is going to, you know, don't do it if you're afraid of it. Or not afraid of it, if you're, I don't want to say afraid, if you're apprehensive of it, then don't do it. But work your way up to it. Jeff worked his way up to it. I mean, he started with a white lightning and then he continued on with, um, what did he continue on with? Rosie Red Rectum, that's what he was saying today. He was practicing with that. And that's some hot stuff, man. Definitely hot stuff. I think I interviewed Jeff a couple of months ago, a couple of weeks ago, something like that. And uh, I had two spoonfuls of that because it was so tasty. And that went straight through me. Should have put some food in my belly, but I didn't. But that went straight through me. Straight through me. And uh, let's see, before we go on with the bites, I just want to say one thing about them. These are, again, by Roger Tria, the Hot Dang Show. They're available at Heating Up the Capital. They're available uh, in Europe from League of Fire. They're available all over the place, if you if you, I think, you know, if you look from Woody Pete's, tons of places available. These are the League of Fire Challenge, and they're worth points, as long as everything is done above and beyond what they need to do. So let's start. Let's bring in the first people. Who do we have sitting backstage for us? So backstage, I have Heiko, I have Heathen, I have Fire in the Hole, and a Hoodie. So you want Fire in the Hole? Hoodie's going to come up afterwards. So you're going to have Fire in the Hole? Oh, oh, yeah. 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 Oh, Greg, are you ready? I'm going to need it. Yeah, well, she's she's not not They're not ready. <laughs> <laughs> bring Heiko in then. <laughs> Uh, Greg's got a whole bunch. That was epic. <laughs> <laughs> Greg does have a few. Greg does have a few people there today, and they'll be doing packing one chip challenges. Awesome. So after that, bring in Heathen. <laughs> Heathen is not quite ready either. Or is he? Or does he want his walk? Oh, he looks like he might be. He's giving me a thumbs up. All right. Hi, Heathen. He didn't do his walk. <laughs> oh, 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 there you go, my friends. You got her, pants. <laughs> this is a long challenge, and you should always wear the pens on a long challenge because you can't leave camera, brother, and I'm not losing points. That's right. Yeah, those I even are... got my cake holder to hide my junk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Greg, are you this ready? Friendly show, you know. Let's try, Let's try Greg and all the fun that's coming. Oh, you're ready now. There you go, bud. Now I'm ready. All right. Battle of the Bastards. Let me hear everybody say, Heathen is a bastard. Heathen is a bastard. Heathen is a bastard. Heathen is a bastard. With an E, just so everyone knows. With an E. Yes. <laughs> Read the shirt. Read the shirt. So we'll start at the top with my group, then we'll go to Heathen, then we'll go to your group, Greg. No, you guys have the disclaimer in front of you, or do you need me oh, to send it? Greg, send um, it. No, I got it. Oh, I'm going to send you one, Greg. <laughs> He's going to send it to you. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Just read it, Greg. Read it, Greg. <laughs> sure. Read it. I'm over 18 years. I, I am over 18 years of age, sound mine, and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from the consuming of this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact. So here's the thing. All the people behind you are going to have to read that too. Yeah, we were going to do it like, yeah, let's, let's do it like last time. That's the way to do it. All right, Greg Marcus. I'm Max Marcus. I'm Kaelin Arnold. 
and over the age of 18 and sound mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from consuming this product or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact without question. Amen. Okay, uh, I need a plate. Can you give me a plate, please? I, I need to go a little bit higher than this. So I'll do mine. <laughs> All right. Um, I, All right. I don't trans one. State that I'm over 18 years old of sound mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances <laughs> be responsible for or liable for any claims or injury that may arise from consuming the products or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this without effect or question. All right. Because I'm a huge creator, so I please be I'm over 18 years of age, sound mind, and have read all the understood the hot sauce and product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims of injury or damage arising from me consuming these here products or multiples thereof. I acknowledge and agree to this fact. Sure do. As Charles Vane would say, let's get after it. <laughs> let's get it. Let's yeah. get the show on the road, bud. My boxes, because I like standing up and showing my legs here. <laughs> what we got right, here? Now, once you open these boxes, they've got to stay on camera at all times. Okay, you see the seals on all three of my boxes, right? Yep. Good. They're staying on camera. So as, I, as you guys are familiar with these, I'll still go over it. Everything needs to stay on camera at all times. There's no food or drink allowed between these. You know, you'll get cumulative points if you just continue from one challenge to the next. You can go basically as far as you can go. Once, uh, if we see you about to hurl, we're going to throw you out. Before you guys start this, do you want to have those guys, Max and them, do packet chips, or do you want to wait till after? Oh, I'm sorry, he's muted. No. We'll wait till after. All right. Kayla can't get, or uh, Max can't get into his packet. All right. So again, with these, this is like two minutes to eat yeah, each just bar. Life. You have two minutes to complete the bar. If you finish the bar in under two minutes, you still have to wait till the two minutes is up before you start the next bar. Once you start the next bar, it's another two minutes. Again, you have to wait that is up until you get the third bar. Once you get the third, two minutes to eat that. You have to wait till the end of that two minutes. Then you begin the five minute afterburn. So each one of these is 11 minutes long. I'm gonna let each one run 11 minutes and then I'm gonna move on to the second 11 minutes and the third 11 minutes so everyone is clear. So if you guys want to open your boxes and get them all ready, make sure that once you open them, they stay on camera. Can you take the bottom comments off so I can see more of, yeah, and see. Purple, red, black. Purple, you may red, have to purple, red, purple red, black. Greg, can you lower your camera or raise your plate? Now I've got Greg muted because they've got a lot of background noise, yeah. but Greg, if you need to be heard, give me a wave or a thumbs up or something and just like, Get my attention so that I can uh, there. unmute you. Perfect. So did you hear that, Greg? We have you muted because of background noise. So if you need, just wave and we'll talk if you need to talk. All right. So if you get the first bar ready, open it up. We all know what that one is. That's the jalapeno milk chocolate. Purple. Definitely. Milk chocolate, habanero. All right, so when you guys are ready, I'm going to count you down. You both all ready? Yep. All right, in three, two, one, and go.
Once you're finished with the chocolate, give me an open mouth, ah, so I know that it's been completed. And then you can wait till we move on to the next part. If you guys saw earlier on, Jeff Davis, uh, uh, I didn't, I was going to say attempted, but he didn't attempt to smash these. You know, he did a, a great job of doing it. And uh, again, we were talking about multiples of consumption of these. And it, it is, it's, it's, it's no joke. These things can get you and they, you know, they're definitely not joke chocolates. And again, I'm going to push that Roger. Roger is very good. Roger Trier is selling these on Hot Dang Show at 20% off. Put in the code SOF, Sons of Fire. Not Sons of Fire. Put in SOF as the code. You get 20% off of your bites when you buy them through Hot Dang Show. Forty-five seconds left. Open mouth from Heiko. Well done. Half a minute left here. Open mouth from Greg. Perfect. That just leaves Abe Lincoln in the bottom row. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect, Heathen. Well done. 47. Get your next bar ready. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stop it at two minutes because I don't want you guys to, you know, I want to make sure you guys are all ready to go. 58, 59, two minutes. We'll stop right there. You guys have your second bar. Tell me when you're all ready. Get it ready and I'll start the next one. Ready. Heiko's ready. We'll be waiting on Greg. Good. Perfect. All right. So in three, two, one, go. This middle one is one of my favorites. I wish they made a whole bar out of it, but then it wouldn't really be a challenge because it'd be a really tasty bar. It's the white chocolate ghost pepper, and it's marked a three on level for heat. And uh, it's really tasty. It's very reminiscent of the white lightning challenge, but... Um, I, you know, like I said, when you eat it before the milk chocolate habanero appears hot, but it's only because your palate is cleansed. And, you know, by the time you get to this one, it's a great tasting bar. You know, I would, I would eat a half pound, I don't know, I'd eat a half pound one of these. But very tasty. Powerful little boxes. Lots of surprises in it. And I, I noticed Jeff was just putting the whole bar in his mouth. Man, that's just amazing seeing that. First minute coming up, halfway through the second bar. We have a minute remaining. Again, once you finish it, give me the open mouth R, and I know that you've completed it. But as with anything, you want to try and chew it close to the time just so that you're not starting your burn early, and then you'll move on to the next. After this, once the four minutes is up, guys, I'm going to pause it again. I'm going to make sure that you can all get ready to prep. I don't want to rush anything. You guys are doing three bars, so I want to make sure we do it step by step by step. So half a minute left. R from Heiko. Need some open mouths. Open mouth from Greg, Raider. Those guys all done back there? What did he say? I don't know. Uh, oh, I just removed him on accident. I'll put it back. <laughs> Unmute him. Unmute him. Oh, yeah. then? Did you open that? Everyone's good there. This is yeah. my yeah. fault for getting me cat pie. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> All right, so get your third bar ready, guys. It's awesome. Oh, this is going to be fun. I remember this one. Just go as far as you can, brother. Yeah, just go as far as you can. Everybody ready on this one? Well, there's two seconds, so I'm going to reset it because I don't trust it. I'm going to make sure that I want you guys to have all the time. Everybody ready? 
In three, two, one, go. This is the last bar. The dark chocolate Carolina Reaper, if you look on there, that black one, and you can see the amount of skulls. It's the full, full, full amount of skulls on there. This is the definite, the one that tests you. The other two are just a build up to this. But the guy directly below me right there is one of the only 13 people in the world to have completed a half pound bar of one of what they're eating right now. A square every two minutes and he managed to do it. And uh, he's got video of it. There's some of it on Fiery Foods. There's some of it all over the place. You can find it. I think uh, you've, got, you've got it on your YouTube too, I'm pretty sure. And it's good to see. So coming up to the first minute of this one. One minute over. There's one minute left. Again, if you guys want to try these, Art Dan Show, Roger Tria. Put in the code SOF and you get 20% off. 45 seconds to go, like with this one. Again, open mouth right at the end. We already lost the next, I think. Well, now I'm unmuted. Okay. All right, 20 seconds to go, guys. <sighs> Open mouth from Greg. <sighs> Open from he then. 10 seconds, <laughs> Heiko. <laughs> Open from Heiko. I'm going to go straight into the five minute burn, guys. So we go to seven minutes. So all it is is now try not too much movement around. Make sure that you just sit and relax because you know you're in it for the long haul. So you just want to suffer. With Everybody that. with a cut except me. I'm gonna get my cut. Mm -hmm. yeah. How's it? Hot. That's why it falls, man. Is it garbage? I'm still like one to ten. He's not wasting time. He's getting his next three ready, but you know you don't. You don't have to. You can wait till you get closer. To you okay? I wish I didn't tap out. Yeah. <sighs> Like, there's no going back because I left the camera. That is so, so hot. Maybe, you know, I'm going to stop it after this one so there's no rush. So you guys can, you know, we make sure that everything is covered here. <sighs> if you're on that, still the pain. They're getting ready. I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm tapping it. I'm, I'm going to tap it. Wow. I, I just, I know I'm going to be sick as shit, so oh, I'm cursing now. That's terrible. Hey, considering what you're eating, brother. <laughs> Tell him he's muted now. He can curse as much as he wants. Hey, you can curse all you want. You're muted. <laughs> How you feeling, Michael? Hanging in there, bud. How about you, Greg? You all right? Put Greg in. He's tapping. Yeah. I'll finish the the one and for the points, but uh, I'm not cutting in. I'm not getting into my second one. I'm I'm hung over to beat the band, and I know it's just going to be a technicolor yawn if I go for a second. So I'm, I I brought the bucket, but I don't want to use it. So that's <laughs> fair. I'll go I'll go as far as you go, Heiko. Is it hotter than the rummy bears? No, actually, no. no. Rummy bears are hotter no. than everything. <sighs> Not the, the, uh, two minutes not the ones up top. The ones that stuck at the bottom, though, holy. The other one, like, I... The one you tried, yeah. yeah. Like I said, that one on the bottom was the one that Greg ate, like, a half pound of. And that, you know, okay, Carol? That yeah. busted him. <laughs> I oh, saw yeah. yesterday, oh, sorry, Colby Ritchie, he attempted the nemesis. And Colby is a... I mean, he's seasoned. He's no amateur. He's put away, like... I watched him put away 15 million SHU jerky and just knock out <laughs> like they're nothing. So, to see no, him, he got this. Shahina, you can't chili clean. clean. That tastes like garbage about eh? <sighs> jerky. Okay, chili Queen says, well done, Greg. Kiss, kiss. Time to get Thanks, serious. Jen. Time to get serious now. <laughs> <sighs> 
<clears throat> I have to turn in my shirt, I think. <laughs> oh, the coughs are the worst. Hey. Yeah, we're done. You to sit down for the challenge. is 90% of it, brother. You're going to be able to see it. You do what you need to do, Greg. Come on. Alan, do you think Peter comes in? Yeah. No, because he might just pretend. Raw, raw pod's way hotter. Yeah, just can't. Uh, all right, we're what done, right? No, we're not. We're at five and a half. We've got yeah, one right. minute and a half. What is it, six minute afterburn? <laughs> five, but it, yeah, five, 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 it's seven five. minutes, two plus five. It's two minutes and then five minute afterburn. So I just reset the clock so that you guys get all yeah. the time in the world. What will... Probably what we'll do, do Greg, oh, is uh, it, are you done? Is your buddy in the oh, back done too after the one? Yeah. No, he's done. Yes. Yes. All right. So what we'll do is, as soon as the seven minutes is up, brother, we're going to cut you out and put you backstage so you can recover and do what you guys need to do. But you know, we'll we'll wait till we get to the seven point mark. After that, Ico and Heathen will just see how far you guys get, and you'll take it from there. You've only got yeah, sorry, like guys. 35, 35 seconds to go. Bro. Dude, you did amazing. I mean, it's I'm fucking... Sorry about, bro. Sorry, pardon my French. No worries. <laughs> Nothing to be sorry about. Oh, I can feel it so hot. Oh, oh, yes, I got the same thing, man. Oh. Oh, no kidding. 10, 9, 8. Seven, you got this, bud. Six, Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Yay. Sorry, no, bud. Good job, Greg. Let's send those guys to recover. I'm going to reset. I'll have you guys. Are you guys set and ready to go? I'm just going to join for some moral support. Yeah, we'll bring the hot mom in for some moral support. I hate chocolate. <laughs> so do I. I mean, yeah. we're in the same boat. I freaking hate it. I know. Just like it's I said, it's like a double challenge. Guys, just ch challenge yourself. You, you know, you guys are freaking legends and warriors. You don't have to prove anything. Just challenge yourself and go as far as you can go. When you guys are ready, give me the thumbs up and I'll count you down. All right. We're going to start this in three, two, one. Punish that chocolate. Or punish those guys, chocolate. <laughs> Both ways works. Both ways works. UK Chili Queen says, good luck for the second one. Yeah, it's amazing that you guys are doing the second one. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I feel comfortable after two. When, when I start moving into the third one, you know, then it's... It's time, as with anything. Like, you know, this this is a long challenge. Yeah, yeah, it's 33 minutes, and that's just with the chocolate. That's not with the times and the messing in between. So, you know, you're looking at roughly a 40-minute 40, 40 minute, cho uh, 40 minute challenge with the incidentals and unpacking and doing all of that. Plus, you're on camera. So it's best to be as comfortable as you can be and as good as you can be. Although, I tell you what, when you taste this bar, this bar doesn't taste as hot as it did first time around, does it? <laughs> because you know, first time around you're like, oh wow, that's kind of spicy for a jalapeno. It's still chocolate. Second time around you're like, I don't even taste this. <laughs> Shahina, they are planning on doing three, I believe. Yeah, three is the plan. Well, we'll see how far they go. Basically, you know the rules, guys. Give me an open mouth when you're done. Forty-five seconds to go. You guys are doing great, amazing. You're you are. stone cold. Just mm, beast mode. 30 seconds remain. <sighs> that was an open mouth and open mouth. What I'm going to do is, as we go on here, I'm going to wait for each two-minute one, and I'm just going to reset it because I want to give you as much time. There's two minutes right there, guys. Start unpacking your stuff. I'm going to reset. 
Give me the thumbs up when you're ready, and I'll move on with the next one. Ready, Heiko? No. All right, perfect. I'm going to count you guys down in three, two, one, and away you go. The second bar in the second box, which is the white chocolate ghost pepper, which is pretty tasty, so hopefully that's... Does that mean they're halfway through the eating one, of the box? Once, once they've done this, they're... Once they've completed this bar, they're exactly halfway through the three bars. They're one and a half through. Of course, you know, as the more boxes you do, the higher the points escalate for. And there's more, the the, the points compound, compound as well, yes, right? Yes. It's not just you so get many this point, points this point, And if you do an extra box or if you do, you know, so many after that. I always have to look at the points every time. Yeah, so it's something, you know, especially on the chocolate challenges. On certain ones, there are rules that, you know, allow you to go beyond it. You'll get certain, you know, even if you don't complete the challenge, there is a certain amount of points to get uh, by eating it. And, you know, just, I, I think, say, for the crunchy one, it takes, uh, I don't want to use the Moab Cola, it takes 10 minutes. If you take 12 minutes and do the afterburn, you'll still get some points. So it's worth it on some of them. So check before you do any of these League of Fire challenges. Don't just buy the challenge and do it. Read. I've done videos. There's blog posts on League, on League of Fire on exactly how to do this. Yeah, you don't want to do them. this and then not get the points for it because exactly. of the technicality. It's just really unfortunate. One minute 30. You've got 30 seconds, guys. Fifteen seconds. Ten. <sighs> Open from here then. Five. My Heiko. Got it. Perfect. Right on time there, Heiko. I'm gonna reset for the next one. You can open it. I got a top. I'm done. If you're tapping, brother, we're going to knock you out right there. Knock him out. Heathen, this is, you know, you definitely want to complete this bar, brother. But then it'll be entirely up to you if you want to go on for the next one, if you want. I'm to not going to outdo my partners. All right, so. I'll do two. Count. I never outdo my my screen partners. It's just against my rules. You know that. I got you. So Going three would just be showing off. I'm fine, but I'll just do two. All right, so I'm going to count you down for this one. Go three, two, one. Punish that chocolate. We can talk about Nami after. Definitely, definitely. I did, a, I did a, a good spiel on it last night. I don't, I know you couldn't get there. I tried to get you there, but it'd be good. It took a nap. I, I did a good 20-minute segment on it, but I'd like to redo it again, especially for today, because. Uh, that prize, man, that prize is just spectacular. I added something to it, too. I bet you did. I know that you added second and third places. I mean, if you want, you can talk about it during your burn down time. If it, yeah. helps, take your, if it helps take your mind, you'll have five minutes there. We'll talk about it then. Right. Then that way, we'll keep your mind off of it. Coming up on our first minute. One minute over. Again, when you show me the open mouth R, uh, I'm just going to let this run through to seven minutes, and that will be the five-minute afterburn. And you're doing fantastic, man. You're doing absolutely fantastic. Brian Johnson says, Heathen, you are one bad dude. He is one bad dude. <laughs> Randy Carolla yeah. says, Heathen is a freaking monster. Yes, he is, man. <sighs> 20 seconds. <sighs> Perfect, brother. I'm just going to let this run through now. When the two minutes is up, you'll have completed the 
first six minutes and eating the bars. Right now we're moving into the five minute afterburn, so we'll go up to seven minutes. So, you know, none of your stuff needs to stay on camera now, you know, but the only thing that needs to stay on camera is you. I better leave that there. For <laughs> 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 modesty. Anyways, this NAMI deal, right? I uh, I saw Dustin doing push-ups, and then I found out why he was doing push-ups, right? It was like mental awareness and, and PTSD for like veterans and stuff like that. And me being a vet, I thought about it and I said, you know what, I should just join in. And like most things, when I join something, I just kind of barge my way in and just do it. And uh, I started doing the push-ups and found out how bad a shape I was in first. And then I start, you know, hey, how about if we just, uh, to really try to raise some good money for Miami, why don't we uh, get a prize drawing? And talk to, you know, the silly people and get get a big pot in there. And uh, it's kind of morphed into this larger, bigger thing. And Heiko's holding the, the uh, prize fund. And uh, it's so much in there. Can you guys hear me? Okay. But uh, I just uh, threw, threw another package his way. I threw, threw uh, one of these type guys in there that I signed off on. It's going to go on the grand prize. There's a second prize pool that's a uh, really nice cutting board. And I might add some stuff from uh, Hell Garden. My buddy Nick Kemp, my homeboy back there, he sent some stuff that's going to be coming in this week that I'll probably put in the second prize fund. Um, some tank and some seeds and stuff like that. And then Heiko uh, got the third place with a line of his sauces, which he donated out of uh, kindness of his heart. Uh, Dave Duran donated shipping costs worldwide. It's uh, it's $20 to get in for the drawing. I've got the big jar. Every entry that's paid for, I put the entry in on camera. And December 27th, uh, we're, we're going to sit down and we're going to try to eat the nemesis. You're going to eat it. Yeah, well, uh, chocolate's not my thing. Volume's not my thing. I've cut almost 30 pounds right now. So half a pound of chocolate for me is like eating five pounds. It's oh, really okay. difficult. So Jeffrey Davis. Not a heat issue yeah. for me at all, but the volume will be a problem. And but I'll give it a go. But on that show, I'm going to go out live. Three winners. One, two, three. Uh, no multiple winners. If, if somebody wins the grand prize and they're not eligible for the second or the third prize, let's be fair because I want to spread the love. But uh, you can donate on, on Justin Johnson's homepage. Um, he's got a link, or you can go to day four or 25 of push ups on my homepage on Facebook. Donate. Um, $20 grant, $100 get you five, so on, you know. So, yeah. So, Donate, people. It's going for a really good cause. Dustin doesn't see a cent. I don't see a cent. None of the people that donated see a cent. It's open to anybody worldwide. Um, there's League of Fire challenges. There's science swag. There's seeds. There's essential oil. Um, all kinds of stuff. I mean, it's, it's the biggest prize fund the chili community, I'm comfortable saying, has ever seen so far. No so joke far. about what Heathen is saying. It's got all the challenges from League of Fire in it, all of them. Um, I mean, you haven't even, it, it, there's so much stuff in there that, that you don't even have time to name it. T shirt signed by Troy Primo by Bella and Dark. There's a t shirt in there that was supplied by Dustin Johnson that's got League of Fire with everyone's name on it, Dustin's. Just, I mean, that there is a collector's item. Justin know. UK Chili Queen and Johnny Scoville signed on the same shirt. The only one that I know that has that is me. I have a shirt with all three of them signed on it. Right. You got Troy Primo signed. You've got a GIF. GIF. You, you. I just sent that. 
You got a Gypsy Fireman signed shirt. You got a Heathen signed shirt. You got a Ed of the Ice Lady signed shirt. It's all good. You have just completed two, brother. <laughs> Congratulations. I like the bites. Yeah, the bites. The bites are very, very tasty for sure. Yeah, they're easy too. Yeah, get after them, people. To me, well, you, you know, if somebody has their tolerance built up, they're fairly easy. It's just a volume deal for me. I don't feel like eating the third one. I could do it. I'm, I'm sure I could. But I also never outdo. If I'm on a screen with you or you or you and we decide we're going to do two or three, somebody falls out, I'm going to finish that challenge, get them on, and stop. Because we're a community. And it's never about outdoing the person on screen with you. It's about, you know, to me, it's a community, you know. So it, to me, if I did that third box, I'd feel bad about myself the rest of the day. I would. It's just how I'm wired, you know. We're only competing against ourselves. Yeah. Yeah. It's true. One but, thing I'd like to tell you, Heathen, is uh, Shahina, the UK Chili Queen, has donated to Nami. She mentions it in the chat. So what I'll say to Shahida, you can either send a receipt of that to Heathen, Dustin, Heiko. You can send it to me. You can send it to Sons of Fire. We'll make sure that these guys do it because on December 27th, that's a special day, is it not, Heathen? My birthday. It's his birthday. Uh, Farmer Jay, from what I hear, is going to be with you. And Farmer Jay tried the Nemesis and he got halfway through it. It knocked him and he's working his way up to that too, so... You know what? It, it's not about, it's not ever about completing the challenge. It's about having the sand and the audacity to sit down and try it. Exactly. Whether you complete it or not, that's what I'm saying. Some great people have tried it. And, you know, it's, it's like I said, it's a strong bar. It's no joke. Definitely no joke. So anyone that donates to NAMI, like I said, make sure one of us send it to one of us, send it to Sun, send it to Brian, I mean, send it to Heathen, send it to me, send it to. Dustin, Karma J, Dave, we'll make sure that uh, Heathen gets it. And then he'll do a video if you yep. check on his he, he Here's does the videos every time he does it. And he wraps it and staples it just so you know that it's in there. And then he puts it in the jar and seals it. So That's right. It's, and it's probably, we're, at, you know, 22, we're at about $22, $2,300 right now. I told the world, and I mean it, we get $5,000, i will get a tramp stamp. Well, yeah, and it will be NAMI, and it will be NAMI charity. It'll be it'll, it'll have something to do with the charity drive. But just so you guys know, he's not joking here. He's already had the tattoo drawn out. It's going to be Mjolnir on the tramp stamp. He's definitely so. If it gets I'm the all you got to do, reach in your pocketbook, and I will do a live at the tattoo studio. <laughs> I put a little piece of tape on the precious area so, so, we don't get, <laughs> so we don't get kicked off of YouTube. But if you want to see Heathen get his hiding tattoo, we're going to have to dig deep into that pocket and I donate know, the name. December comes along and I might do a, <laughs> an online something to raise money just so we can get 5000 to what you get. There. And by the way, I got my eye on you, Dave. I know you got something planned. I don't trust that fellow now when it comes to money and getting somebody tattooed. No, I trust him with I trust him with my life. Good guy. All right, brother. Well, well, you did I know you're up to something. Yeah, you did a fantastic job in smashing those two. Big congratulations. More points oh, thank you. on the board. Thanks. Uh, it was fun. It, you know what? Being on screen with Greg and Heiko again was a lot of fun for me. Um they didn't have a lot of time to to get prepped and whatnot, so Three, well, I don't care, whatever. We did good. Good enough. We did. So when you submit this to League of Fire, uh, after the festival is over, there'll be a, a, a YouTube screen, a YouTube link for you to submit. And your timestamp is two and a half hours. So when you submit it, if you say the Bastards is at two and a half hours, League okay. of Fire will just go to two and a half hours and check it. So you don't have to send a single video of it good stuff well you I'll guys have sure you, you know i'm not very techie so you'll guide me through it if i need help i know that Definitely. no worries 
All right, brother, we're going to let you go so you can recover. I love you all, people. Be good. Have a good holidays and donate to Nami. Don't make <laughs> me show my underwear again. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, brother. Talk soon. Well, as you saw there, Heathen Raider knocking two bites out of the park. Uh, Greg and his friend knocked one out of the park. Heiko got one out. Ah, well, he knocked one out of the park, but that second one got him. But, I mean, Heiko had a busy morning, man. He's, he's been going at it all, all morning. So, you know, he was, he was shouting.